years ago, we installed the concrete cow yard with uh, some grants. That was a that was a big improvement. We had quite a quite a mud hole there, and you can see the pond drains down through there and around the back of the cow yard. That was a good program a hundred years ago when they let their cows out once a day to uh, for water, but in this modern day and age, it doesn't work. So that is a is a big improvement. We really really are impressed with that. That collects all the runoff, takes the takes the clean water away, and the dirty water goes to the other side of the creek, downhill from the creek, and it's filtered out into a grass area area. So that has pretty much eliminated the uh, the runoff issue there. You can see the. Uh, the, uh, the runoff system from the from the cow yard. These pipes collect all the clean water from the roofs, divert it away from the cow yard through this pipe and over. It has to cross the creek there, gets over into the diversion um, drainage area. Not been a problem. I thought the ice was going to bother it, but since we got the cows completely fenced out of it, there's no more silting. It doesn't plug up. We have a nice clean stony bottom, and uh, we're, we're very impressed. Now, Ed, where does the barnyard water go? Just over the right through there. Okay, so that goes over well, through the. Collects into that. There's a screen box. Yeah. With three different size screens to catch the solids, and then the liquid goes through that pipe and it ends up over there. So it goes right out over the pasture. Yep. Well, it never gets that far. Okay. It just leeches into the ground. 